Hey beloved, I just came by to give you this quick prophetic word. The Lord says, as your days are, so shall your strength be. In the book of Deuteronomy chapter 33, as, as Moses is giving the words of the Lord to the tribes of Israel, he says to Asher, Asher is most blessed of sons. Let him be favored by his brothers and let him dip his foot in oil. Your sandal shall not be in iron and bronze. In other words, you shall not be yoked or in bondage. As your days, so shall your strength be. And so he was prophetically decreeing over Asher the children of Israel, as they were going into the promised land, as they were going to have to fight the battles to get into the promised land, that as their days, as things came in the season that they were entering into, that God was going to give them the strength they needed to break in, break through, and possess their inheritance. And so I prophesy that over you. That is a word that the Lord has given me that I've had, I have hold, held on to through the different seasons of my life. That as my days are, so shall my strength be. Whatever the day brings, God will bring me the strength to face it. And so I prophesy that over you, that whatever your day, whatever your season is bringing, as you're taking your first step into your new beginning and your new season, you're stepping out on faith and walking on God's word, that as your days are, so shall your strength be. That you can do all things through Christ, which strengthens you. And so I decree that over you and I just came back to say that to you and I want you to receive that and I want you to claim that Deuteronomy 33 and verse 25 as your days so shall your strength be God is going to give you the strength you need to make it through this season and not just by the sweat of your brow not just barely, but he's going to give you the strength to win, to get the victory, to enter into his rest, enter into his blessing and the things that he has for you in this season. You shall recover all in this season. You shall enter your promised land. Where Will there be battles? Absolutely. There will be some battles that you have to face. But God's promise is this. You are blessed and you are highly favored and you're, you have been anointed it with oil. He said, You're, let him dip his feet in oil. In other words, the anointing and the chains of bondage, the iron and the bronze cannot stay on. They will slip off. They will fall off. Whatever the enemy tries on you will not work. Bondage will not work. Whom the sun set free is free indeed. And so as your days are so shall your strength be and no weapon formed against you shall prosper in Jesus name. And so I speak that over you, especially those of you who are entering to this new season, doing a new thing and taking steps of faith in Jesus name. Amen.